morning of moonlight around the moon because of the high clouds that are already out there early on this Friday morning. We'll see those steady high clouds most of our Friday and temperatures you know, will not be warm, but not exactly frigid. We start off in the low 40s. Uh, we'll finish in the upper 50s and the wind should be pretty quiet all day long. Now on Saturday we're 62. We haven't had a day in the low 60s since early January and it was only one day at that. So it's been a while since December since we had a couple days in a row in the 60s, but that's the game plan this weekend. You think perfect. I'll get outside. We encourage that, but we encourage you getting outside on Saturday. Uh, by Sunday afternoon, we're going to have a mess of wind to deal with. More on that in just a second. Medium pollen levels through the weekend. And then first time in a while, we've got a high allergy forecast on Monday, mainly ash and juniper pollen. Temperatures upper 30s and low 40s this morning will be in the upper 50s this afternoon. But tomorrow we hit the low 60s by the end of the weekend. It's in the mid 60s, but here's the rub southwest gust of 30 to 45 miles per hour in the forecast by Sunday midday and Sunday afternoon. Now our Friday night still calm Saturday still calm. Enjoy that we will cool down near 40 tonight. So a calm couple of days today and tomorrow, but then by Sunday, particularly midday through the afternoon, the wind starts to get a little annoying out there. Some blowing dust is going to be possible. A couple of spotty power outages because of these gusts from the southwest with 65 Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, then it is a north breeze Thursday as well. And that'll keep us a little cooler in the upper 50s to near 60 next week. Let's talk about the roads.